Arthritis in the wrist can be osteoarthritis, which is wear and tear arthritis, or it can be caused by autoimmune disease, rheumatoid, lupus, and it sometimes can also be caused by fractures, missed fractures or treated fractures, and can also be caused by ligament tears. So, of course, when we initially see a patient with wrist arthritis, we try to treat them with non-surgical treatment options, which may involve bracing, steroidal creams, physical therapy, and cortisone injections. Once we have tried all these options and nothing has worked, then we consider surgery. Now the thing about the wrist is that the wrist is a very unique joint in that the wrist has eight different bones. So this, our wrist joint right here, has eight different bones. There's actually four bones here and four bones here. So arthritis in the wrist sometimes involves only some of the bones, but not the rest of them. So there's a variety of surgical treatment options available. For example, sometimes we just remove some of the bones. We'll just remove half of the bones inside the wrist and leave the other half, which is normal, and it'll function just fine. In other instances, we'll remove some and fuse the other ones. It's called a limited wrist fusion. We actually take a plate and screws and we fuse some of the bones so that the whole wrist is not fused so that the patient will still have some mobility. Because you can imagine that complete loss of mobility in the wrist can be quite disabling. For instance, if somebody is right-handed, it can be hard for them to even go to the bathroom because you need a little bit of mobility to go to the bathroom. So a completely fused wrist can be disabling in that respect. So we try our best to preserve motion inside the wrist. So sometimes we'll do a partial fusion. Sometimes we will do a complete fusion and then a more recent, more modern advancement is wrist replacement surgery, where we do a complete replacement of the wrist, the advantage of which is that they'll still have range of motion and mobility, and they'll still get painless.